In a world fighting against climate change, the goal of achieving net zero emissions by mid-century has been challenging. Let's explore the global progress towards this goal with a focus on Qatar's efforts. Countries are transitioning to renewable energy to achieve net zero emissions. The UN advises reducing carbon dioxide emissions by 45% from 2010 levels by 2030 to ensure our planet's safety. This would limit global warming to 1.5 degrees Celsius and avert the worst effects of climate change. Since the 2015 Paris Agreement, countries like Denmark, Germany, Norway and China have invested in wind, solar power and electric vehicles. Meanwhile, Qatar, which is known for its fossil fuel reserves, is making concerted efforts towards sustainability. One example is the Tarshid program, which aims to conserve water and electricity, reducing resource usage significantly. The Gulf state is heavily investing in renewable energy projects like the Al Kharsa Solar PV project, aiming to generate 10% of its electricity from renewable sources by 2030. Qatar's commitment was evident in its pledge in hosting a carbon-neutral World Cup in 2022. And education and research in climate science has also been prioritized across the country's institutions. But are these efforts enough? Are we on track? Unfortunately, Experts agree that more needs to be done. In January 2023, the doomsday clock was moved forward to 90 seconds before midnight, the closest to catastrophe it has ever been. Countries like Qatar are leading the way, and it is evident that sustainability is not just an aspiration, but a necessity and a reality that the world is gradually moving towards.